I'm Sister Greta Ronigan, and I became a fellow, this is my second year, so a year ago, and I'm a member of the Community of Divine Love in San Gabriel, California. I developed a program called the Good Seed Project. It's six classes to be conducted in the Los Padrinos Juvenile Hall, which is in Downey. And the reason that we picked Los Padrinos, there's a unit there where the girls are facing higher charges. Mm -hmm. I developed this program um, to put it directly into Los Padrinos, to sort of embed it in their culture, and um, which has been very, su very successful and I couldn't have done without this, without this support. I know that this is what we're called to mm -hmm. as, a, as a church to see Christ in all people. And those who are in the crisis of incarceration are acutely uh, suffering and also deeply longing for change, for transformation, and for deeper faith. And so it's a very, very important ministry. The communities that these young people are coming out of are like a war zone. They're systemic problems of poverty, of drugs, of gangs, um, that they have never, often never have, some of them have no support, mm -hmm. no family member, no, no grandmother, no aunt, no uncle who has ever reached out to them and held them in any esteem or illustrated to them that they are of value. Mm -hmm. So this is like a, a lifeline of, I don't know, it feels so critical um, that 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 as many of us as possible can sort of help them reimagine themselves as valuable, as purposeful. It seems to me that not only the Episcopal Church, but all of us called to serve God. There should be legions of us out there trying to create um, some support for for this kind of suffering. It was an, a, a deep affirmation that this is the right thing, that I'm supposed to be doing this, and I'm sure other fellows feel that way. The impact is so palpable, and um, I think at some point I'll have the girls write a thank you um, before this pro you know, during this program year of what it has meant to them, because some of these girls now is the second, I'm going into the second year of being with them. And um, it's family now. So, and that's all because of the support. So, thank you, thank you, thank you.